The spring trip to Talladega is always full of surprises. We come in here with eight different winners in nine races. Uh, a lot of fellows looking for their first win, and a lot of fellows today just looking to get to the end of stage one in one piece. <laughs> Mike, the action started right from the beginning. I think lap like four or five, they started to get single file. I was like, oh, what's this going to be like today in Talladega? And that went out the window on the next lap. And then they were two and three wide, bumping and banging. And all the action that we've come to, to know at Talladega started to be created at the end of the, all these stages. I think the only thing that I think can think of that is predictable at Talladega these days is there's going to be a pass on the last lap, <laughs> and it might be Brad Keselowski who wins it. <laughs> and there's going to be a big wreck. <laughs> and there's lots of big wrecks. <laughs> but for me... You know, it just checks all the boxes. That's what I love about this place, the heart rate. I, it's the first time I've ever had an opportunity to watch one of these races, and it was the same way. Like, I could put myself into my heart was pounding. You know, you didn't know where to look, where that block was going to come from, where that big run was going to come from. You saw the 21 move up, take that risk, and go for it, and that opened the door for Brad Keselowski to win. Love this racetrack and love this type of racing. So looking back at it, had you been Matt Benedetto, and had Ryan Blaney been coming with such a run, would you have moved up or would you have stayed down? Well, you said looking back on it. Yeah, heck it's yeah. It's easy right up now, here. <laughs> should have stayed right where you're at, Matt. <laughs> Unfortunately, that happens in a split second. You're, 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 you're listening to your spotter. He's telling you runs. you got to make that decision, and he went for it, and unfortunately it didn't work out. What a day. Uh, you know, what a weekend for, yes. you know, to get back to the racetrack here at Talladega. It's such a fan-friendly racetrack. We saw a lot of people camping, people in the grandstands, and we're starting to just gradually get back to some kind of normalcy. And Talladega does that for so many of us. And then it also offers up incredible racing and wild action on the track. So now we're at nine winners in ten races, and we head for the Great Plains and Kansas. For more great NASCAR on Fox content, subscribe to our channel. It's somewhere right around here.